Hello everybody and welcome back to an episode of the new save file. We are jumping in again and you know what? I'm so supremely confident in my streak right now that I kind of want to play Tinted Lost. I know it's just such a terrible idea and I'll definitely die, but I don't know. Something's speaking to me, but there is also... Do, no, do you know what? We'll do We'll do Tainted Keeper and we'll go to Mother. I feel like that's not as hard, but that is also a difficult... Um, a difficult challenge regardless, and I'm quite down to, um, I'm quite down to play a bit of Tainted Keeper. I think he's very, very fun. As for the question of the day today, uh, I know it's a little early, but I just, I, I have, like, news on this to talk about, so why not? Um, like, does anyone have any big plans next year? Um, because I've basically just been planning out some stuff for next year, and so it's at, at the top of my mind. Ooh, baby. Um, that is a good trinket. That is a good trinket. I will definitely take that for a bomb. Mini Mushy is pretty good. Um, although we are going to get a devil deal this floor, so we'd probably rather keep our money for that. Right, wait until these things jump over here. There you go. Oh, dude. The chances of that happening are not super low. They are not super low. I am liking this. Okay, that was a little bit foolish of me there. I tried to get that penny, but I couldn't quite get it. We could end up getting a room here that causes us some trouble. We do have some flies to help out. Ah, there you go. It's fine now. I'm fine. Okay, you got you, you float away. You keep her going. You, you do your thing. Dude, that is not a low chance of happening at all. This is, this is quite nice. Also, the money gains so far have been pretty outstanding. Only thing here with an XL floor is we do, of course, lose out on um, an extra shop, which is always a shame with Tainted Keeper, but yeah. Anyways, yeah, so as, as for the, my sort of part of the question of the day, basically yesterday, um, me and my girlfriend spent um, a bunch of time planning out our holidays for next year because... It's kind of a big year next year for us. So, so for one, we're going on a holiday with my family. Uh, we went to Greece last year, and we've just booked a 10-day holiday in October for Greece next year. So I'm very, very happy about that, because that was just an absolutely fantastic holiday when we went, and we're going to get to go for more time this year, so I'm really, really happy about that. Um, the other thing is we've booked a holiday to Venice in March, because it is mine and my girlfriend's 10-year anniversary. So we're going to have a proper, like, special... Holiday. We have not really done that before. We've not really been on holiday much together, to be honest. We've been to Amsterdam uh, on our own once, and Greece, but my family were there. We went we went on our own, but my family were there at the time, so it wasn't really on, my, on our own. But uh, Venice will be, like, our first proper, proper <laughs> holiday, just us two, um, which is crazy, considering we've been together 10 years. Like, most people go on holiday way, way, way before that. Um... But yeah, I'm really excited about it. I mean, she's been to Venice once before with work, uh, but she didn't. She she did get to explore, but not too much. Um, so it's going to be exciting for us to go and explore, sort of thing. Ooh, adoption papers. Hmm. Okay, let me just quickly see if there's an interaction between Tainted Keeper and Adoption Papers, because there might be a specific way those shops work. Because I don't want all familiars, obviously. Um, Isaac. Adoption papers, there it was. See if there's any special interaction. It doesn't say there is, because it... Oh, wait, 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 wait. This applies to all shop pool items when playing as Tainted Keeper. Familiars, um... Okay, so... Basically, it would overwrite literally everything, which I don't think is a particularly good idea. Oh, we got a planetarium this floor as well. Wow. We don't have a key, unfortunately, so that's a little bit of a bummer on that front. Little bit of a bummer on that front. Not much I can do about it, though. Oh, there you go. Beautiful. Beautiful game. Thank you. Right, so let's see what we've got going on in here. we got Neptunus. I'll 100% take that. Thank you. Neptunus is pretty darn good for us. We've got a second item room here. That's also really good. I'll probably take that. Um, right. Hold up here. That was not a kill I wanted. I ended up passing through all those guys and killing a bunch of enemies I didn't really want to kill. Okay, we do have this here as well, which I'm obviously going to bomb for more money. We want to be going into the Devil Deal with at least 30 cent, really. We've not even seen our shop yet, so we could get something amazing here. 
dude. Marquise is lovely. I'm really liking this. And also, Neptunus is just kind of great for us right now. Okay, shop, what do you hold for us? Um, we'll definitely take that. Ooh, honestly, actually, yeah, Mr. Me is kind of amazing here. I just realized. Um, not particularly happy with the fact that I've just screwed myself for HP, but game, you are, you are generous to me. Um... Hmm. No, I think I think I want to steal um, Muramycosis or whatever the hell that item's called. Now, I do believe that with Mr. Me, it's not a guaranteed chance to steal. Yeah, it can fail. I'm I'm still gonna take this though because it's really good. Yeah, I gotta say I'm pretty sure it can fail, but still, Mr. Me is pretty goddamn good for us here. Remember, we're going to be doing Mother here, so it's good that we ended up getting a second key. We are doing Mother, right? Yes, we are doing Mother. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. I'm going to say, having this trinket plus this item, really good stuff to have together. Ooh, that's very good. We'll come back and have a little look at that. Like, being able to stick all these, like, straight away like that is really, really nice. Try and move out of the way of this. We can wait for our uh, Neptunus to fill up and then start attacking again. I'm not going to get all of this money, unfortunately. Check out the Devil Deal. Um, I'm actually not too impressed with the stuff in there, to be honest. What was in our... What was our item there? Little Brim's pretty good. I'll take Little Brim, why not? Bar of Surf is probably better, but I'm going to take the damage up here. Um, there's no way we can get an extra charge here, is there? I'd like to buy the Bar of Surf as well, to be honest, but sadly it's not going to happen. Oh, well, I'd, I'd probably have rather had the uh, Bar of Surf than Little Brim thinking about it. I just kind of forgot what the item was. I, I kind of didn't really look before leaving the room. Little Brim isn't, isn't all that good. Oh, really? Am I going to keep walking to literally every enemy here? Um, that's useful. I'm not going to use a key on the item room yet, because item rooms aren't super valuable. I I'm, I'm really unsure whether I regret not taking, um, what's it called? Um, not taking adoption papers or not. Because I feel like it could ruin our shops and cause some issues. What's going on here? Oh, there you go. Uh, it could ruin our shops and cause some issues, but at the same time, we could have got some really good stuff out of it, so... Good. This is a good room for money. Lots of very, very easy to kill enemies. Hopefully we'll get a, a dime and nickel, all that sort of good stuff. And we, we very much have been getting a lot of nickels so far. I mean, money-wise, we've been, like, doing absolutely fantastic this uh, this run. We've not really had any issues with gaining money. I mean, obviously you never do as this character, but I mean, like, in terms of the, the money we've, we've been getting, the types of money we've been doing really well. Foghorn boys. Be somewhat prepared when they're about. Shop, this is why we want to keep our key. Oh, shop's always open as this guy, aren't they? Okay, so we definitely want this. Um, I'll try and steal this, because this is decently good. Eee. Um, I guess I take a battery charge and go back to the item room here. At the minute, I am sans bombs. I don't have any bombs right now, so it would be good to get those. Right, yeah, I gotta say, good idea to go to our item room here, because we might be able to steal another item. We should be able to get a lot of items here with Mr. Me. Yeah, I don't even know what that is, so I'm not going to take it. Obviously, the uh, Yokart is completely pointless. I don't know if I've ever had a run where I've used Yokart, you know. It, be it very rarely shows up, and whenever it does, I, I feel like I'm never the characters that can take advantage. Right, good, good. Um, was there anything else in the shop I wanted to buy? I don't think there was. This is the last downpour floor we have access to here, so we do have to be careful. I've just also realised we've taken damage in this room at a very bad time.
Okay, good. That's all I wanted. Lovely. Right, so at the minute we need two bombs this floor. So I think we're kind of screwed out of doing Mother right now. I don't think we can do it. I didn't really think about the fact... Yeah, we have one bomb in here, but... Unless we go into a secret room that has more bombs, I don't see how this could work. Hmm, I've maybe screwed myself a little bit here. Did I use a bomb this floor? I can't remember. Um... So what I, what I can do is here, I can buy this bomb, and then I can at least do the mirror room to see if I get another bomb from a room drop. That's currently my... my herp. That's the only really herp I have access to. Wherever our mirror room is. Do we remember where our mirror room is? Oh, it's literally right next to it. I'm stupid. We should hopefully get one bomb drop out of this. I'd, I'd herp. The game can be cruel sometimes. Oh shit, this enemy's still here. Gotta try and pick up the money here, but it's not a, a large priority. Right, item room. How are you? Ah, there you go. We got a bomb. Lovely. I feel a lot more secure now. I'm definitely not doing that boss again. I feel a little uncomfortable about that. But I will do some of these other rooms that are going to give us a lot of money. Now, I did miss out on a good bit of money there, but... Overall, gained quite a lot out of that room. Marquise is lovely too. These guys need to keep my distance from because they're the ones that can hit me super easily. Good, good. All these big rooms are just the ones I want to do because they are, like, full of pretty easy to kill enemies. Or we can gain a good amount of money. Oh, Lord. Oh, he was a champion as well. I didn't really expect that. Yeah, see, look at that. Look at that amount of money we just gained there. I don't think going to the shop here does anything, does it? No. I don't think so. Right, don't use a bomb on the, uh, on... I was going to use a bomb on the little keeper dudes in the shop there. I was like, wait a minute, no. <laughs> do not do that. Do not do that. Right, we've got our, we've got our uh, knife piece. We are fine and dandy to skip, skip, skip along. And I think this is a pretty good run so far. My only regret so far is taking Little Brim, because we could have got Angel Deals, and we could have got, um... We could have got away with having a bit more tears, which obviously isn't super important, but it would be nice. Uh, I'm just going to check my shop again, make sure there isn't anything super good in here. Nope, there is not. I don't think any of those things really matter. Although, Dreamcatcher could save us some money in the future, or uh, like keys at least, but not super intrigued with that. Do you know what? I've just realised, I'm pretty sure Mr. Me would have just opened that door for me had I, um, had I sent him towards it. I don't know for sure, but I feel like he would have done. Yeah, now that's a room where I ain't getting any of the pennies. But we're up to 70 coins at the minute, so I'm not particularly worried about that. Good, good. I'm loving the uh, Muramai curses we've got going on here. Oh, I, I have literally no idea what's going on with these enemies. Yeah, what the fuck? What the hell are they? <laughs> I've literally never seen those enemies in my entire life. That was a very, very horrible way to end the streak. I just... That happens from time to time. And I, I still... I, I, I genuinely cannot believe it still happens. Where oh, this is obviously a horrible, horrible room to get first. We've miss out on all the money. Um, but um, th this happens from time to time where I'll, I'll like walk into a room and it'll have a fiend folio enemy that I've literally never seen. And I just have no idea how to deal with. Like, I didn't really get how that enemy fired, and I just kind of whiffed. Eh, it is what it is. It's it's bloody annoying. It's really bloody annoying to to lose a pretty good run to that. But I just didn't understand what was going on. I was. Trying to figure things out, and I couldn't. <laughs> My brain too small. What I should have done is, I should have just, like, backed away. But there wasn't really much space to do that. Can you calm down with all the spiders, my guy? Trying to make this work here. Bad trip, fuck you. But we knew this character was a risk going into it. I don't mind losing the streak on a streak of three. It's not exactly a monumentous streak, is it? 
I'm just hoping we can have as good luck or better than the last time with nickels and dimes. And so far, it's looking good. Increase the chance of treasure room, uh, tainted treasure rooms to spawn. Eh, why not? Tainted treasure rooms are only valuable once you have a tainted item to replace. So we need items that work with the rooms first. But pretty good stuff, I'd say. Beautiful. Oh, for fuck. <laughs> These goddamn spiders, man. Right, uh, what we got going on in here? I think I honestly take all of these. Tainted disc, devil disc, boss disc. Um, I'm, I'm gonna take this instead. I think, um, hairpin has the potential to be really good. I'm really annoyed that we lost that run now knowing- Oh, what the fuck? My bottle broke. Okay, there you go. Oh, dude, this has, like, major knockback. This is horrible. When I use this, it like knocks me back really far. Oh, dude, this is this is gross. <laughs> Whatever this bottle thing is with the synergy we've got going on with that, I do not like. I would like rid of this immediately. <laughs> it has super super low range, and it knocks me back as well. How the fuck do I get in here on any of these? And yeah, when I when I break it and when I walk into a room, it cracks for a little while. Did not like that. Did not like that. Dude. How does one boy keep taking so much damage? Yeah, get, get rid of all this crap, please. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Was not a fan of the items I was given there. We do have a tinted rock there, but I'm rather trying to keep my bombs. If we can get a key, that'd be lovely. That's what I'm sort of looking for right now. Oh, for fu Burning basements is the goddamn worst. There's all these coins available, and they're just sitting underneath, like, so much goddamn uh, fire. I don't want to deal with all the fire. Right, more bombs is lovely. Right. We don't have any keys so far. Um, we will check out our item room over here just in case it's any good. Let's take a little look-see. It is not. Nah, can't, we can't do anything with that room, sadly. Away we go. Right, hopefully our boss item's better this time. And yeah, hopefully we get a key, I guess. Sacrificial blood, not sure where that came from, but I'll take it before the boss fight. Why'd you spawn the disc all the way over there? God damn it. Shot disc. Try and take this little buddy out first if we can. Not always easy, but it's nice to try. You can kind of push him over the wall as well so he can't hit you, which is nice. Okay. Good, good, good. We got Hurst on Toast. Eh, yeah, why not? Why not? Okay, we can't go down to that floor yet, so let's uh, hold off on that. And we'll go to go down next floor. It's always going to be the issue with a character like this. There's always going to be a chance that you... Um... We've got Humbling Bundle for a short time here. Um, probably not long enough to, to make major moves with. But... You might be able to get a li little bit extra money. Be fair. Boom, boom. I say boom, boom, boom. Let me say, hear you say it, wayo. Stop with all the goddamn fire. It's getting a bit old. Right, shop. You hold chaos, yes. Um, and lead pencil, which I'll also take. And do you know what? I think I can take the multi capsule as well. Especially this is a flat. Fire it up, it's always nice. I'll bomb this guy as well. A little bit more money of that back. Okay, I think Chaos should be pretty darn good here, right? Getting Angel Deals and Devil Deal items in our shops is going to be fantastic. Don't set things on fire, you goof. Uh, 
Okay. Don't bother using a key on that yet. Let's just... Might as well get the planetarium chance instead. We kind of whiffed last time. We should have just taken the planetarium chance. What the hell's going on over here with you boys? Okay, no worries. Keep it going. Like I said, I always want to get 30 for the devil deal. Although, at this point, to be fair, devil deals really aren't that important to us. Because they're, they're going to be regular items. But devil deals are just going to be treated as additional treasure rooms now, essentially. Although, saying that, yeah, the treasure room's probably more valuable now that we've got uh, chaos. So, I might want to go into the treasure room, actually. Let's see how much money we end up getting by the end of this floor first. And we'll sort of decide based off that, I guess. Do you like a bit of lead pencil as well? Lead pencil is very nice. Good, good. And then one last fella here. Not bad, not bad. Okay, arcade, I guess, is worth one penny to see if we can get more money from it. Unfortunately not. We've got an additional bomb there. That's lovely. We've got the key we need. That's good stuff. Okie dokie. Art of Chucky. Uh, yeah, I'll pop in here real quick and see. Jar of Flies is pretty good. I'll take Jar of Flies. Jar of Flies is pretty good additional damage, I'd say. Yeah, all of our discs are just completely random now. That's kind of better, to be honest. So we got Spindle to get all these discs every boss fight, but they're all just completely random discs now. Papafly isn't really that good. Um, Botfly, however, is pretty good. We'll take Botfly. Don't really need Latchkey. Papafly will leave. This is going to be a fun run. I, I, I'd, I'd go as far as to say this might even be a more entertaining run than the last one, had it not have crashed. <laughs> Honestly. That's the first time our Isaac has crashed in a while um, to something that isn't a specific mod erroring out. Like, we had one with the Steven floor having a crash, which is a bit, a bit different. That's the first time I've had, like, a random crash. I wonder what caused that. Unfortunately, it does probably mean we have to replay that entire floor, which is a bit sucky. Um... It, it, it always annoys me the way the game saves like this. I really, like I said, really wish that there was a mod out there that, that basically fixed how mods save. I'm going to go to the big room first here while I've got Humbling Bundle. And try to get as much money as I can. I kind of forgot this big room was kind of slow going, to be honest. And also, it's very hard to actually grab all the money. Fuck's sake. Okay, this was a terrible idea. I'm going to get less money than I was going to get otherwise. Bollocks. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hold up. This is double damage till we next get hit. Wait, what? No, this is... This is the already broken. Really? I was like, yeah, double damage till we next get hit. That's amazing. No, that's the already broken stick that does nothing. You are, you okay up there, buddy? You feeling all right? Goddamn. Huh, got it. So the, the money drops aren't the same as they were before, before the, the crash, which is interesting. Right. Golden Penny is, of course, very good until it does that. Although, to be fair, I am willing to bomb it in the case that I can. Oh. Really, game. That was a bit mean. <laughs> that was a little bit mean. Right, pop in here. Grab ourselves some chaos. Grab ourselves lead pencil. Grab ourselves this. Okay, at least this gives us the same stuff. And we go to our item room now, and we get uh, the jar of flies. Okay. Actually got the chest this time, which is nice. Sadly, was not worth.
Oh god. Oh, fuck you. What the hell? I kind of forgot that that enemy did that too. Just a lot of forgetfulness going on right now. A lot of me not knowing what enemies do, regardless of the fact that I've seen them a thousand times. Right. Go quickly grab Jara flies here. And now we exit and continue, which creates a save just in case the game crashes again. It means we don't have to redo everything. Need to be the same stuff? It will be the same stuff, okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm, like, I'm really liking the fact that our discs are all randomized now, that's pretty fun. Come in here, grab this bad boy. Get an extra bomb here as well. Lovely. And we go. Right. Exit. Continue. Just in case. Second save. I don't think it would crash again. Unless it's a specific interaction we have. No, it didn't. Okay. Cool. Okay. Oh, we got boiler this time. It's all nice. I do think boiler is a little bit harder of a floor, so it might cause some trouble. Oh, wait. These things are all enemies? Oh, no, no, no. Wait, what? Okay, no, they, they are enemies. I just can't kill them. Slightly confusing, but we got there in the end. Ooh, the noises those guys make are really cool. Extra sack. Baby, that is nice to see. Lovely extra bombs to put in my belly. I've not really been looking for secret rooms this run so far. I realize. Oh, God. Yeah, that was just, like, basically guaranteed damage for me there. And neither of those guys dropped anything either. Mm. This is risky, but I'm gonna do it. Yeah, basically my hope was that I'd have some HP in there. But the Seraphim baby's pretty good. Not Seraphim, whatever it's called. The Godhead baby. Pretty good. Oh, dude, that shot is, uh... Not something I'm particularly fond of. He only dropped one penny, which is kind of scary. This is yet another enemy slash boss that I just don't remember what they do. I do remember they drop pennies when they die. Good, good, good. Okay. Reasonably happy with how that went. It was a bit, bit scary, cutting it a bit too close to the line. But I would say, overall, good stuff. Oh god, what the fuck? Uh, no, no. Man. Well done on that. <laughs> Again, don't know what these enemies do. It's getting me killed a lot. I don't know if you saw what happened there, but they just... I didn't realize that any enemy in that area had a sucking ability, and they just all sucked me in and boxed me in and threw tears fucking everywhere. That room's pretty crazy. Anyways, I guess I'm going to leave it there. Pretty pathetic episode, but hey-ho, it happens sometimes. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.